How you doing? Come on back, I got something to show you. You know, one of the great things about the pace of life up here north of 64 is that a man feels free to execute his projects in stages. Exhibit A. This old dryer quit running about five years ago. I just lugged it out of the basement this winter. Lugged. I mean, sometimes a man has to lug something. Anyway, the project is currently in storage phase. I'm storing it out here in the backyard. I don't want to store it in the front yard. That'd be ostentatious. Well, I tore the big 220 volt cord off this thing and gave it to a guy in town who collects copper and sells it. He's a recycler. He doesn't have a think green bumper sticker or a pair of hemp shorts, but he's a recycler. You know, speaking of recycling, you could refurb this baby, paint her green and gold, and bingo, you've got lawn statuary. Or other things. I think I could use it for a minnow tank or a worm farm, dog house, carp smoker, tool repository, any number of things. You know, I'd take a little engineering, but you could you could turn this into one of them chain sorters like they got down to the bank. Of course, the, the guy would have to do a little bit of rigging. Could slap a couple of straps on it and donate it to the high school marching band. Of course, the high school football team could always use another tackling dummy. You know, the bottom line is, I'm just grateful that I live in a place where a man can throw his used dryer out the back door and nobody finds it all that unusual. We've got to be 47 cents worth of change in here. Hey. Hey, there's a gray sock in here. 